On today's episode of the Jamaican Cooking Journey, I will be sharing with you how to make some greens and red herring or let me say, what's that thing? I don't know. You remember your people, you call it um, smoked herring, smoked red herring. This one is, it has the bones and I, you know, I scalded it off and I picked up it and most get up most of the bones, but you can do the boneless one. So we're trying to pair a smoked flavor with some greens right here. If you know what I'm talking about. Okay. Let me pause here to say special thanks to my patrons that have been making my page possible. And if you would like to be a member of my Patreon family, look in the description of this video and all other videos of me. You will see the link to my Patreon page. So right here, I've got my Kalalo all cleaned, washed, and chopped. Okay. How do you do it? I have a video, I think in the first year of my YouTube career here, I have a video that I showed you in depth how to prepare your kalalu. You can use this with any greens of choice too, okay? Also, there is a video from in that very same year, 2017, I showed you how to prepare your red herring or smoked herring. So I did it. So maybe if you're new and let me also say welcome to my new subscribers and also a special big shout out to those that have started this cooking journey with me. So I'm about to say if you are watching this video or watching my channel for the very first time, you might want to say, how did she not show me how to prepare the greens and how to prepare this? Yes, I did. But those videos are long gone. So I would also um, encourage the people that are new here to go watch and watch back the older videos. There are lots and lots of things there that you would be surprised that you're thinking that I did not do. So right on over here, I've got me some oil being preheated right here. And I have got me some garlic. I've got lots of garlic. I've smashed my garlic. And I'm going to tell you something about me and this smashed garlic with these greens. I've got some fresh green thyme. I've got some um, tomatoes. I've got green scallions. And I've got me some chopped um, white onions and two slices of green scotch bonnet pepper. My oil is like not too hot and I'm going to put it in, put in it in right now. So I'll be sorting off my veggies or my little, you know, my natural seasoning should say, these are not vegetable. Yeah, maybe only tomato vegetable in there. So I'm putting it on a reasonably high heat because the bottom of my pot is thick and I'm going to let it stay there and start stewing down okay i would say stew down this one now i have smashed my garlic i am using a small amount of greens as you can see but i like a lot of garlic in my greens yes i like garlic a lot on a whole but in my greens i like to have my garlic tasting if you're a person that like lots of garlic in your greens comment and let me know I want to tell you that garlic brings out a lot of flavor in greens. You can just steam your kalalo with a little salt, a little piece of thyme, put in lots of garlic. You'd be surprised to see how nice it is. And I want to say I like the, the, the I, I smashed my garlic because I want to taste the, the cooked garlic in my greens. And if you're somebody like that, tell me. But if you don't want to use garlic, don't use any garlic. So I'm leaving that there. To stew down a bit and I'll come back in the next clip okay okay so let's take a look at our you see that stewing them down well, let me tell you flavors these flavors they never go away the scallions the garlic and if you notice I put the green thyme in there yeah flavors the kitchen was infused with just you know that mixed of all herbsy flavors now it's time for me to put in the smoke flavor so with all those natural flavors we are now adding in this smoked herring a smoked herring we're adding in a smoke flavor inside here now you could do this one or of two ways that i think you could either put in your kalalu to steam with your herbs and then as it goes halfway you add in your um smoked red herring so or you could do it i prefer this way but tell me which way you prefer because i i i, I kind of like this way but you could do it one of two ways let me get my flame down a bit and this is the time 
with my clean hands, I'm going to be putting in my greens. As I said, you could do this with any greens. This would be nice with mustard greens too. You know, mustard greens has that bitterish taste. So I always like the little bitterish taste and the smoky taste. They go together well. You could do it with, I know you know you could do it with your colored greens as I've ever seen. But you know, colored greens is not popular in Jamaica. But I would try it definitely with some mustard greens. And at this point, I'm going to put my flame, cover my, my pot, and I'm going to put my flame down to the lowest because we're going to be steaming that kalalu in that mixture, that moisture that our herbs, our, our seasonings have produced. I'm going to cover it down and maybe another five to six minutes, I'll come back to see what is happening. I'll catch you then. Look at that. So I'm steaming kalalu here. Okay, I'm not stir frying color. Look. So, you see that? No water. I don't need any water. So, for time, look at it. Look at it. All stalks. So, you know the thyme leaves have all been um, inside of it. It's there inside of it, you know. Oh, you see that? You see? That process that it went through? Yeah. Look at this now. Look how beautiful this is now. So, you want to get your stove? even lower and you're gonna no we can put and i'm not gonna be using any salt as i'm saying i won't be putting any salt because the this the erin is a little you know putting in some black pepper you know to taste to gig it up a bit that's the final thing yeah but you could put where you want maybe you want to put bell peppers and that yeah i i don't want to put those so i'm putting these Decent is a gig of black pepper, and you're going to mix that up in there. Oh, wow! Who could ask some more? So, as I said before, you could do this another way. You could steam down your kalalo, and we have our time again here. This was good, good preparation, good stewing, good steaming. No leaves are on the time, therefore, everything is in there. Look at this beautiful. So, I'm gonna cover down my pot. And I'm going to put it on the lowest heat there is. And I'm going to wait until my kalalu is all steamed to my liking. Do to your liking, fam, not to anybody's liking. And you notice we didn't have a lot of kalalu. So you do the, 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 the herring in accordance with your greens. Because you want to see it have that nice, you know, this nice look. Look at that. Shoot them up on that, dad. So you're gonna cover, make sure your pot is, you're using something that's tightly covered so it can continue to produce extra steam to finish up this color look. I'll catch you in the next clip. Let's look what is at what is happening. You see that steam coming off my lid? Okay, you see this? This is finished and we're gonna be turning off our flame. Give it that one final thorough mix, yeah. I've had it. I haven't had it anything, but if you, depending on how you do it, you feel like you want to add something, you should ahead of time. And this is what it looks like. Smoke flavor. Smoke um, erin and green. Smoke flavor and greens. I have here some, this could be served with white rice, anything of choice, yeah? So I have here some dry gongo rice and peas, a little veggies for you, you know, so... If you're craving something nice like me, generous amount of greens. Let me clean up this plate now and come back, come present. From my kitchen to yours, from my Jamaican kitchen to your family table, to your plate and most of all to your stomach, it is smoke flavored red erin or smoke flavored erin and greens. Please do enjoy. Now, if you have liked this video, remember to give it a big fat thumbs up. Remember to make sure that you're subscribed. When you do subscribe, click the notification bell so you can be notified. Remember, go back, check out the older videos. Thanks for the new subscribers. Thanks to those who started the journey and are still here with me. Smoke flavor red erin, our smoked red erin, and greens, Jamaican color. That's what we did. Thanks for, uh, for watching once more. Why am I so tight on? I think I'm hungry. Let's go eat. I'll catch you again with another video.